9 inch gap 2D printing. Why do you call it a 9 inch gap 2D printing? Because there's a 9 inch gap between the quarter inch boards. So they're actually smaller than a quarter inch. And then we got the water jugs. This ain't about seeing how the bullet's actually going off trajectory. This is just seeing when it hits. The difference from here to here with nothing. And then entering the water with the next boards. And that's it. And what are we using today? We are using the 6.5 Grendel. Right there. Hornady Black. 2D 9 inch gap printing. All right, here we go. On the nine inch cap, into the first board, nothing. You know, just regular hole. And then we got the second hole. So there ain't, ain't much deviation in the bullet going through um, the mill that would be a half inch, whatever half inch board milled these combined. This is where it's interesting, is we blew this one in half, but you can tell the hole is bigger coming through now this is already board gap board water jug and then this one and then there's a this one after the another water jug so we've lost momentum so there's where your your force is right there and that's it's interesting how the uh, the hole I guess that's still carrying the shock wave with it because you can definitely tell without that one piece you can still see that the hole is a lot smaller comparing to my finger that is actually my whole first little indention and that is my fingernail covering on the second one and I do for non-believers did have it marked one two three four right there yep and this is what's left of the bullet right there so there you go 9 inch 2D printing gap I was curious on uh, this is what I was mainly curious of but that is a big difference between these and then finally hitting the water and it's kapow so it basically releases that energy here and that's what's left like on the coconut pop test cantaloupe pop test it released its energy in that cantaloupe which blew up that board behind it and didn't do nothing the rest of the way. So there you go. Cool little test. Thanks for watching.